end of the day all of us are different and all of us will lose weight different and all of us take different things to lose weight but Happy Saturday. Your girl is about to get ready and run to Sam's real quick. I need to go get some stuff to stock up on for the house. Paper plates, napkins, paper towels, and stuff like that. So I'm going to go run to Sam's. But I have already been out and about. When baby got off of work this morning, we went to Walmart. Um, she got groceries and stuff. And I still haven't decided what's for meal prep this week. So I didn't buy groceries. But your girl went in on some clothes from Walmart. When I say we got to stop sleeping on Walmart, y'all, we got to stop sleeping on Walmart in this vlog right here I'll show you all the pieces that I got I end up getting um they over here that's what I'm looking I got four shirts no five shirts because I got four t-shirts and like a cute little crop top shirt um three pair of wide leg like pizzalo pants I think that's what they're called a dress and a rumper and I think I spent like $75 like it's lit it's cute it's trendy for the summer so I'll show you guys that I also went to Dunkin this morning and got me a iced coffee this right here is the treat that I've been treating myself with on Saturdays especially when I have a good weigh-in day which I will talk to you about later in the vlog as well because I just kind of want to update you guys on my weight loss and what's going on and stuff like that but yes as you can see your girl been drinking on this because I had this when I broke my fast and I broke my fast at 10 5 today and it's 12 9 now so sorry I didn't start the vlog earlier I didn't even think to vlog I'm like Crystal you are a vlogger why are you not vlogging this so I didn't even think to start the vlog early so I apologize but that's okay because we're gonna pick it up from here I'm gonna finish out my iced coffee what I'm gonna do now is go refresh my hair this is pretty much how my hair is when I wake up in the morning um and it looked better than this before I went to Walmart but your girl been lounging on the couch and stuff so it look a mess but before I go out this time I want to go ahead and refresh my curls or whatever um and then I'm gonna run like I said to Sam's I may go by my mom's house because she was able to get us some mask and some sanitizer and i need to go pick that up and stuff like that so, yeah, so i just got some errands to run and then i'm gonna come back home and do my saturday cleaning because i normally clean up on saturdays every week just to you know keep everything fresh and everything like that your girl has been doing some shopping so i have some packages coming um macy's is having a black friday sale so i got some stuff from macy's um i bought me some bundles so i'll go over there because i told y'all i am tired of refreshing my curls so your girl's about to get a sew in um, um, so I bought me some bundles, some hair, and I, I bought, oh, I got, went to Bath and Body Works, bought stuff. I went to Bath and Body Works and I ordered online, so I got stuff. So, yeah, it it's not going to, I would say probably, it's not going to be in this vlog because I'm waiting on these packages to get here. But I can't wait to show you guys what I've been buying. But, yeah, I'm going to take you guys with me into the bathroom and just kind of do a montage and show you guys how I refresh my curls every day. Because I do get this question. I don't know what type of hair I have, y'all. Like, if y'all know, like, once y'all see my curls, can y'all? Y'all tell me what kind of uh, curls I have. I mean, what type of hair I have because I don't know. I remember one time I did some research and then I said, I think I was on Snapchat and I was like, I think I have 4A or 4C hair or something. And a lot of people was like, sis, you do not have 4C or 4A hair or whatever. So I don't know what kind of hair I have. And the only products I use on my hair is a water bottle with only water in it and Eco Styler Gel. That's it. So you guys will see how I refresh my curls and get it going. I am going to just put it back up in this puff. I might do me some cute little curly cues or whatever just to like switch it up for a little bit. But yeah so that's what's going on i don't know what else will happen in this vlog because i kind of don't know what else will happen today um but i did just want to do you know regular vlogs for you guys because i do understand that i'm on my weight loss journey and stuff like that but this is like my vlog channel like my life channel so i do want to make sure that i am incorporating you know just everyday kind of activities in it and not just all about weight loss even though y'all know this weight loss thing is real to me <laughs> but anyway let's go in the bathroom and refresh these curls mm -mm, child this is what i look like when i wake up <laughs>
so I am put together. I threw on some earrings. I bought these from Walmart too. They were like $4.88. I just like to have some studs, although baby said it's time for me to get some diamond studs. And y'all know I still want to get my Chanel earrings. So I'm just holding out and I just threw on this shirt. Oh, hold on, let me turn the camera around. So yeah, nothing major. I just drew on this shirt. This is from Old Navy, it's a size large. And then these leggings, these are from Walmart and they are a size large. And y'all know I have had these shoes for like three years, which I'm definitely gonna get me some more furry slides. I love them just to throw on, especially to show off that, that petty. Uh oh, y'all see some of my Walmart stuff. But yeah, so this is what I got on and I'm gonna carry my, uh, I'm just gonna carry my Michael Kors crossbody. And I'm about to get ready and go to my mom's first. Cause she said um, that her and my dad are gonna go somewhere later. So I wanna get over there. So I'm gonna hold them up um and then after that we'll go so let's go okay guys i was just about to leave and i heard somebody knock on the door and i was like we even have no company and i go to the door and and your girl got a package i did get this mat and say home sweet home and it's kind of like 3d rays from walmart and it was like 1088 wasn't that much but yeah let's see what this is Oh, this is a bad angle and bad lighting but i want to see what this is oh okay so if you follow me guys if you follow me guys if you follow me on instagram then i posted that i read up on my um total life changes stuff my iso t nutriburst and stuff and that's what this is i just did that on thursday and today is saturday and it already came and i do not pay for overnight shipping or nothing i just get standard shipping OMG, I got another re-up, another re-up. Okay, so with this one, oh gosh, okay. So I have another regular um, ISO T. Another regular ISO T, so this is a 50 pack. Another uh, Nutriverse, cause I love, love this. This is my vitamin. And lastly, you know your girl, this is my most favorite product ever. I'ma keep it coming in RG. So pretty much what I do is I have myself on smart ship. So every month I will be getting this. Now, like I said before, I do like the CBD tea, but I like the regular tea too. So whichever one I get, I may go back on there and buy another. You know what I am? Cause I'm gonna buy the lemon tea so I can review that for you guys. Cause I've already told y'all about the raspberry lemonade. So I'ma go on there and get some lemon tea. So I can review that and that's a CBD tea as well. But yes, but your girl got a whole nother re-up and I will keep re-upping on this. I'm so excited. It came so quick. Man, man, man. Okay, so anyway, now a leg up. All right guys, so I'm back in the house. I did go to Sam's, but Sam's didn't have anything. My mama told me too. She was like, don't even waste your time going over there because the shelves are empty. And she was right, shelves are empty. So I ended up just running into Dollar Tree and running into Big Lots. So I'll show you guys what I picked up cause it was just house stuff that I picked up. But since I'm vlogging, I'll show you guys what I got. And then I'm going to show you guys what I got from Walmart whenever um, I went this morning to get clothes. So first things first, Dollar Tree, y'all. I'm just gonna show y'all. Yes, sis, Dollar Tree has Premier Proteins, the caramel version. If y'all been following me, y'all know this is what I use to make my protein ice coffee. It is my favorite. The date on here is December 28, 2020, so they are not expired, and it was $1. So I did only pick up four because, again, these are for my protein ice coffees. I really wish they had vanilla. No lie, if they had vanilla, I would have bought like 30 of them <laughs> because y'all know that's what I use for my green smoothies. But um, they only have the caramel flavor. So, yeah, I picked up four of these, and I have one in a refrigerator. So I I have five just whenever I need them. But yeah, all the dates on here say December 28th. So they are still in date and they were only a dollar. So I paid $4 for this. And if y'all buy these at Walmart, at Walmart for four is $7.97. At Kroger is nine something, and at Walgreens, because I went to Walgreens to buy them, they were $9.99 for four, and I got these for $4. Like, come on, Dollar Tree, get some more flavors. <laughs> but I got that. I also picked up a sponge holder just to have in the sink, um, because we use a sponge or whatever, so I wanted to get this. It has the, uh, what is this, adhesive, or like the, the, where it sticks to the sink, so I picked that up. I also picked up another play cover for the microwave, the one that we had, we had for a while. So I went ahead and got a new one and all this stuff is from the Dollar Tree. Um, and then in this bag as well, I picked up, 
these two little cute vase decor pieces they were at the dollar store of course one dollar and it's like big enough to put like two or three little flowers so i'm going to make a cute little flower arrangement and i'm going to put it on my desk or somewhere on my bookshelves in my room i don't know if i'm gonna use both of them in the same area or if i'll put one on the patio because y'all know the patio is black and white so i might make a cute flower arrangement for the patio and then one for my office but yeah i picked up two of these and they are glass vases and they are so super cute i'm sorry if the light is too bright but yes i am loving these i couldn't pass them up they were only a dollar and then also from the dollar tree every time i go i like to pick up the reynolds wrap pop-up foil i love using this because y'all know you girl lazy so I, I don't like ripping i just like popping it out <laughs> so i picked up two of these and i always just pick up two whenever i go to the dollar tree because i think we have one another one in there and then one that i opened so yeah i just like to pick those up and then i also this time picked up the parchment paper and these are also the pop-ups because i made a sausage and cheese drop biscuit which don't worry i put it on instagram but all y'all was like video me please so don't worry i will be uh, recording it but it did request for parchment paper and not foil and i know why um so i picked that up as well and then lastly from the Dollar Tree. I, since I have been doing so many like cooking videos with you guys, like showing ingredients and stuff, I've been wanting it to be cute. So I picked up these clear bowls and this is 12 packs of them. And again, I'm not using them for like the oven or the microwave, but it's just to put ingredients in um, whenever I showcase it. So yeah, I picked up 12 of those. I also picked up another four pack of these bowls. I've been using these already and I love them. They are dishwasher safe and I just like to put the ingredients in again so it can be uniform. So I picked up those. I also picked up these bowls. They come in a two pack so I got two of these and these are just like clear bowls and again these are for like recipe videos because I like um, the clear stuff so you guys can see it through the actual you know container and then i also picked up one of these this is a measuring cup and it's plastic now from the dollar tree once you use it in the dishwasher or wash it a couple times um the red does come off so you do have to buy it more than once but it's no biggie for me i like to use this you know I really technically don't even use it for a measuring cup because I'll measure stuff before I put it in here. But I like it because it pours well. So when I'm making like my egg muffins and stuff, I can pour it in there really easily. So yeah, I picked this up from the Dollar Tree. And I got a couple more things. Um, I got some super glue because Courtney is always asking for super glue. So I picked that up. I also found this cute little like ring dish. I was called a trinket tray. And it says Miss and it's scratch out and says Mrs. and it's black and white. So I thought this is something cute that I could sit on my desk um, to like put my rings in because my uh, wedding band and stuff is too big. Um, so I always like am taking it off, but I thought this was so cute. I do have another one that says Miz on both sides that I got as a wedding gift, but I use that in our bathroom. But yeah, this was like my office color. So I thought it was a cute little trinket tray and it doesn't have to be for rings. Um, it's a tray. So whatever I decide to use, I can put that on there. And then the Dollar Tree and stuff, they game up a little bit, y'all. So they have Ponds, which is a name brand um, brand. And these are the facial foam face wash. And I got the Pure Detox and I got the Clear Solution. So I want to try this out. I do have face wash that I use right now. And as you can see, these are like a smaller size. So you could probably use this. I mean, if you don't use so much, you can probably use it five or ten times. But yeah, I want to try these out. And it's by Ponds. And then also, I found these free men's one-time use masks and I got the um, deep cleaning Manuka honey and tea tree oil and this is the clay mask and cleanser and it's for oily slash you know um, breakout skin instantly deep cleans absorbs oil without over drying and it's a dual action mask and like I really been like trying to be on my self-care game you know keeping my skin up especially since it's summertime because I get super oily in the summer so I've been trying to be on my face I mean on my uh, skincare game so yeah I picked up this mask I also 
also picked up the Purifying Avocado and Oatmeal Clay Mask. Now this one is for normal to combo skin. So if you have normal skin, you can use it, but combo is oily slash dry skin, meaning like your T-zones may be oily and the rest may be dry. But yeah, so I picked up this one. I also picked up the Mud Mask and Scrub. This is deep clearing seaweed and sea salt, and this is for oily slash breakout skin. So I got this one, and then lastly, I had to get a charcoal mask because this is lit. Um, this is the gel mask and scrub, and this is the polishing charcoal and black sugar for all skin types. So yes, Freeman's is a name brand. Like I buy my Freeman's mask from Ulta. So when I saw that Dollar Tree, like I said, yes, it is like a maybe if you don't use a lot, you could probably get two uses out of it. But I know me, I'll probably use the whole thing in one mask. So I can't wait to do some masks and stuff like that. And I, and I got them for the Dollar Tree. So I'm so excited. And that's everything that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And then, like I told you guys, I needed to get paper plates and some paper towels. That's what I was going to Sam's for. And they didn't have it. So I pull up at Family Dollar and go in. They didn't have it at Family Dollar. But next to Family Dollar was a big lot. So I probably should have stayed out of big lots, but I went in anyway. So... <laughs> The first thing I got from Big Lots is this oversized, easy to grip um, col uh, colander. And I needed this. Like, can y'all believe me, baby? We, like, I have a little one. Um, a little one that I've had for so long. But for one, it doesn't hold everything. And then two, I've had it for years on top of years on top of years. So it was kind of time to get another one. So yeah, I just got this. Because baby especially said she wanted spaghetti this week. I'll be making some homemade marinara sauce and stuff. Um, but yeah, I use this whenever you drain your meat. Or you know, whatever you need to drain stuff. So I got this from Big Lots. And it's a pretty good size. Also from Big Lots, I did pick up our paper towel. I love Bounty. I used to be a sparkle girl. But now I love Bounty see one because i like that it's the selector size sheet so you don't have to you can you know get the small skinny one so i like that and then for two these big rolls last us a long time and i did buy two rolls last week and we are still on the first one so we have an extra one and now we have two more i'm trying to get the sams so i can buy it in bulk but they don't have it at sams they don't want your girl to be great but it's okay because these two packs do last a little while so i went ahead and picked that up and then also from big lots this is the fabric softener that me and baby use, the Swartel. Oh my gosh, she got me hooked on this. It smells so good and it makes your clothes smell good, no lie, for up to 45 days. It tells you up here 45 days of freshness and they not lying. Like, I love this. Um, Like, me and baby can hang our clothes and when you go get that shirt, you know, next week or so, you can definitely... Yes, you can definitely still smell it. So I love this and I always buy like this. And I think this big one is seven dollars anywhere you go. So yeah, I love getting this. And then also, and also for laundry stuff, I picked up OxyClean. I love this. This is a versatile stain remover, but it also like is an older blaster. It gets your clothes like colors cleaner. I mean colors vibrant and whites and stuff. Like it doesn't claim to say that, but I do tell the difference. And they do have one that says older blocker. And then they have one that um, has something to do with like your clothes. But I use the regular one and I see all that stuff. So I like this. This, I can't remember how much it was. But yeah, you just need one scoop in your laundry. And I'm telling you, like, you don't have to worry about nothing. And especially, I know Courtney work at the Waffle House. So every time she come in here, she smell like a Waffle House special. You know, so I like to use this on her uniforms and her aprons and stuff like that. And it really gets this smell out. So using this, this is like what helps with the wash. And then going through with this, y'all, she be smelling so good at work. I also saw this Febreze double pack for $5. And this is limited edition. It is berry and bramble. And I have been obsessed. Like, especially in the summertime for some reason. Like, I love sweet smells. Like, um, wildflower that we got in the kitchen right now is pumpkin pecan waffle. And I just love, like, smelling that on the summer day. Don't judge me. But it is what it is. But, yeah, when I saw that this was strawberry, I was like, okay, this is going to be lit. So, I picked this up. You can never have too much um, Febreze. And then, I really did get plates. So I picked up the everyday like bowls or whatever. So if you just need to throw some in there, um, and these are microwave safe and 
uh, grease resistant, cut resistant, and stuff like that. And then I also did pick up everyday plates, 100 packs. And here is just 24 because we really don't use these, but I like to have them on hand. But we do go through plates a lot. And I am on the search for some dishes because we're going to actually like switch over and start using real dishes and stuff, especially since we're in our new place. But right now, I still haven't found anything that I just have to have. So, paper plates it is. And then plus, like, no lie, who wants to keep washing dishes? I don't care dishwasher or not. Like, who wants to keep doing that? So, yeah, I did go ahead and get the plate. So I got that from Big Lots. I also picked up this Dr. Teal's. This is what baby likes to use whenever she's taking her bubble baths in the morning. Especially like being at work and stuff and you know moving around being on her feet for 12 hours and stuff. She likes to come home get her a good bubble bath and soap. So I went ahead and picked this up and this is the Relax and Relief with Eucalyptus and Spearmint and that's her favorite scent. So I picked this up at Big Lots. And on to the last bag. I don't have any kitchen towels yet and I really like am looking for some more. Like I haven't found any that I want, but when I saw these at Big Lots, I said this will do for now. And it says this is my happy place. And it's black and white with just like a little bit of gray in it. And these are a two pack kitchen towels. And I don't know how much it was, but it's two of them and they are pretty thick. I like the material of them. So this will get us through until I find the ones that I love. And then also we didn't have a, a pot holder or the little, um, you know, mitt to get stuff out. Like we literally been using towels to pull stuff out the oven. So I went ahead and picked this up just so we can have and it has like, you know, you put your fingers in there and be able to grip the pots. And I like these because it does have the grip on it. So that way won't nothing slide. And these are the two piece oven mitt and pot holder set. And they, both of these are by Master Cuisine. And yeah, I don't know how much they were. I want to say this was like $5 and this was like $5. I don't know, but it matches the kitchen. I'm thinking the kitchen is going to be black and white. I'm starting to think everything in here is going to be black and white and gray because that's me and baby's favorite color and I just need to stop like fighting it and just actually decorate it. So I'm not really sure. But yeah, I picked these up as well. So that's everything that your girl got from Dollar Tree and Big Lives. Like I said, it really wasn't like I was going looking for anything. I was supposed to get plates and I ended up with all of this stuff, but y'all know how it goes. And especially, like I said, since we're in a new place, when I see something, I need to buy it. You know what I'm saying? So, so I'm going to go ahead and get all this put up and then I'm going to come back and show you guys the clothing pieces that I bought from Walmart. Alrighty guys, so I got everything put up and I thought, you know what, let me go ahead and do the weekly weigh-in update with you guys. So you'll have that information and then lastly, I'll go ahead and show you the clothing pieces that I got. So y'all know that I have been back on track fully. Um, I do the ISOT, NRG, and Nutriverse. That's what I do as far like my detoxing and then as far as my journey or my calorie counting, point counting, whatever you want to call it, I am on the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. So I have been consistent with tracking every day and now i am back doing weekly weigh-ins so every saturday is when i weigh in so last saturday i weighed in at 215.8 and this saturday i weighed in at 213.2 so your girl lost 2.6 pounds this week and one thing that i noticed is like literally i was mother nature was here the beginning of the week monday and tuesday so i was like super bloated and stuff um so i was like like I knew I had lost weight but I was bloated mother nature was here I had water weight on me my ankles were swollen and stuff like that well I finished mother nature on Tuesday so Wednesday I decided to go ahead and do it at my full day fast because normally I do it on Mondays but since mother nature was here I didn't do it Monday I just did my regular intermediate fasting so I did my 16 8 and I did that Monday and Tuesday and then I said you know what Wednesday I'll go ahead and do a full day fast um since I didn't get to do it Monday. Well, y'all know how that NRG is set up. Your girl did not only a Wednesday fast, I did a Thursday fast as well. Because I just wanted to like not force myself to eat. I wanted to see if I would get hungry with the NRG. And legit, I fasted for two days and 17 hours and 30 minutes. And I was not hungry <laughs> whatsoever. But I did force myself to go ahead and break my fast on Friday. So Friday, I went ahead and broke my fast. And I had a smoothie for breakfast. For lunch, I had tuna. And then for dinner, I had meatloaf muffin cups. Like my same like meal prep and stuff. Because 
again i don't really be having appetites no more i have been trying new recipes like i said if you guys follow me on instagram then you see that i posted a recipe um from the ww pound dropper that is sausage and cheese drop biscuits and like i said earlier don't worry i will make a video on it it's very super simple but i wanted to try it first to make sure i knew what i was doing before i tried to show y'all what to do so yeah that would definitely come up next and then um somebody asked for the recipe for the broccoli and cheese soup that i made and i'll go ahead and make that too maybe i can make both of those in the video and then just use that for meal prep maybe that'll happen i don't want to do that for meal prep this week coming up though because baby wants spaghetti and i make the marinara sauce uh in the crock pot like homemade or whatever and it makes a ton so she's gonna have spaghetti and then i can use it and have low carb spaghetti with spaghetti squash ground turkey and that marinara sauce with a little parmesan cheese i think that's what your girl gonna do this week for meal prep because I'm already making a marinara sauce. So that's what we're going to do. But anyway, yes. Yeah, so now I am down, what's that, 23.8 pounds. And I'm loving it, y'all. Like, honestly, I am not working out like I should. I did start a July challenge. And we've been doing planks, lunges, and squats. And that's been going really good. Um, but to, like, actually get in full cardio, I haven't been doing that. So to see the scale still going down y'all i'm i'm shocked too <laughs> um but i feel good and this week i actually am gonna get on my cardio i got my pre-workout right here in the pantry so when i come home your girl gonna be on her pre-workout so i can go out here and get some cardio like i told you we got a biking trail a walking trail there's like a little workout area um that i can go to that i can do jump roping and do like some sprinting like back and forth or whatever so yeah i'm gonna get up on my stuff this week because again i am loving the way my body is looking i love the way that i feel but the thing that i want to do this time that i didn't do the first time is actually tone while i'm losing i don't want to wait till i get to wonderland and then try to tone because that's when it gets difficult so i'm going to go ahead and get on my stuff this week i want to start back waist training because i haven't been waist training either so i do want to start back waist training while work out and stuff like that so i'll be back on that so next vlog you know you will get updated on that so yes all of that was said because now your girl is back in her size large like fully again if you follow me on instagram or any of my social medias y'all know i posted a picture my size 12 skinny jeans that i tell y'all about all the time like when i don't weigh myself those are what i keep trying on to make sure i don't you know go too crazy well i went too crazy and those didn't fit anymore and i remember taking a picture on june 20th when i tried them on and of course i had lost some weight then but I went ahead and tried them on just to see where they were. And I was like, okay, this is where they were. And then when I weighed myself, I was like, you know what? Let me try on my skinny jeans and see how far they come in, you know? And boom, baby, here's the picture right here. They go all the way up. They button, they zip, like they do everything. So I'm so, so excited to um, be back in those skinny jeans. And the reason those mean so much to me is because those are junior size 12s. And that just means they're like, I'm losing fat, like everything is going down because a plus size 12 fits no problem, but it's whenever you can fit into the junior sizes is whenever I know like, oh, we made it. And that brings me to the Walmart. So the reason I end up going to Walmart is because your girl don't have any clothes. Like I gave away and donated so much stuff when we moved and then I had lost weight. I mean, I had gained a little weight, right? So I was like, okay, well, I don't want to go shopping now because I know I'm going to lose weight. So now that I have lost 23 pounds i am back like for some reason and i have to attribute this to the detox tea to the iso tea because my stomach is so much flatter now and that's because i'm daily detoxing so my the bloat is constantly like being taken out um so i can definitely 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 tell a difference and now i am in a size large at walmart like their size large is an 11 13 11 to 13 or whatever so that is what size all the clothes are but i said all that to say i went yesterday online and i looked at fashion over and pretty little things and fashion to figure and i looked at everything but i really don't know what size i wear so i was like you know what i need to pick up something from the store so I can try to get a feel for what sizes that I am. And Walmart, <laughs> we went to Walmart and Walmart, don't sleep on Walmart. They got some little cute stuff, stuff just to throw on right now. Cause this is not nothing that you know I would be 
to consider dressed up but for the stuff that i do like today i can wear one of these outfits to move around you know to run errands and still be cute or whatever so, so yes your girl went and i got a couple of pieces and i did try them on like when i got them whenever i came home this morning i went ahead and tried them on and then i was like you know what i should just record this part so i can put it here that way you can see how it looks on my body or whatever and like i said i am 213 i am almost back in wonderland which i'm so excited about i do tell a difference in my body and I doubted myself whenever I picked up these sizes. Um, I was like, I don't know if these are gonna fit. So that's why when I tried them on this morning and they all fit, I was like, oh, I gotta tell somebody about this. So let me stop rambling and jump in. So the first thing that I got were these um, pants and these right here are the wide leg, what I call them Pizzolo pants or whatever, like they are fitted and then they flare out at the bottom. And I think these are so cute. I think you can wear them with a crop top, you can wear them with a regular top, or you can, you know, do whatever you want with them. You can dress them up and put heels on with them. Well, probably not this material, but I do have another material that you can. So you can like dress them up and put heels on with it, or you can wear it down, put slides on or tennis shoes, whatever you want to do. But yeah, I just picked this up. Of course, you know, your girl had to pick up a black pair. Now, the one thing that I am shocked about is the suckage like this right here suck you in so y'all know I still do have loose skin in my belly area and I like the way this fit like normally if I was to get something like this I would wear a longer shirt but it sucks you in and you look good so yes I'm okay with that and these are a size large and they were $7.88 now this shirt does not go with these pants like I didn't buy it to go with the pants but in the try on I did put it on with the pants and this is so cute it was only five dollars and this is a size large and i like it because it has the um ruching here at the front so as you can see you can like actually turn it into a crop top or you can wear it where it's not scrunched up or whatever so it's versatile whichever way you want to do it now it is kind of sheer and see-through because i can see slap through the camera but just wear a black bra or a black uh bralette or a bandeau or something like that and be cute sis it's the summertime it's time to show a little skin <laughs> so yeah Yes, it was only five bucks so i picked that up now i also picked up these t-shirts these are a size large as well and these are semi-fitted but they have a little stretch to them um and these were how much were these these were three dollars and 98 cents so yes i picked up this golden mustard color because again you could throw this on with jeans leggings or anything like that i also picked up a white color because why would i not and i also picked up a burgundy one and i'll show you guys why and i didn't even know this until i got home but yeah i picked up a burgundy shirt in this color and like i said i love the fit of these because they're fitted but they have stretch so you don't have to worry about them they hug you so it doesn't look sloppy but they stretch so you don't you know be squeezed in them or whatever so yes i got these and when i got this shirt and then i saw these pants just like the black ones i had to get them these are printed they are so cute the suckage is real and again they go down and flare out and this was so cute as y'all can see in the little charm part i like this outfit together like i said you can put it on with some um cute like black um shoes or whatever whatever you decide or have you decide to do it but yes i picked up these pants with that shirt and then of course since i got a white shirt like that i had to get a black shirt and this is a size large they all were 398 and i got a black shirt because you can wear with everything but i also did pick up the black and white pattern pants and these are a size large and they were 788 as well and they flare at the bottom too so when I saw the black ones and then I saw the burgundy ones and I saw these, I was like, you know what? I like the way these fit. Let me just go ahead and get them in these colors. So yeah, I picked up these as well. So these, like I said, are not like dress up clothes, but your girl didn't even have leisure clothes. Like that's stuff that I can just throw on, be cute when I'm out and about and don't necessarily have to worry about being like too dressed up, but I look put together, you know what I'm saying? So glad I picked that up. And I got two more things that I am like, Super shock Walmart hat. So the first thing that I picked up was this really cute dress. It is a dark floral dress. This is a size large and it was $16.96. And it has some straps and I like on the straps that they are adjustable. Um, and then on the back part it has like 
I don't know what that's called, but it's stretchy here at the back. Like the front part and the bottom part has no stretch, but here at the back, it has a little bit of stretch for you. Um, and it has kind of a, a sweetheart neckline. And I think that is so feminine and so cute. Um, and as y'all can see in the try on, it does have a split on both sides. So it is summer friendly, although it's a dark floral, the flowers are, you know, summer appropriate, even though it's a black dress and it's a maxi and i just think this is so cute put it on with some cute sandals or you know some cute heel sandals open toe sandals like it's too lit for lit yeah so this was 16.96 and i just love the way it fits and lastly your girl had to do this and it's a romper how cute it also has a sweetheart neckline it also has the adjustable straps now this material is way different from that that material does not stretch only at the back but this material actually stretches everywhere and it still does have a stretchy back as well it still does have the sweetheart um, neckline and both of these have like a little padding here so if you can get away with not wearing a bra you don't have to worry about like the nipple showing because it does have some padding in it but it's a whole romper sis as y'all can see it is too uh, cute i like it it's floral again it's a dark floral but it is i feel summer appropriate because of the flowers and like i said they um it, as y'all can see it come like kind of calf length or whatever so you can dress it up or dress it down so those are the items that I picked up from Walmart again I'm not trying to be out here being flashy your girl just needs to put on something because I lost weight and I never really like started on my wardrobe like I always said I would but it's time so don't y'all worry I'm gonna be hauling it out again I have a cart on pretty little things I have a cart on fashion nova I have a cart on um boohoo like i literally literally have carts on there but the reason i haven't hit buy is because i don't know what size i wear and i need to get to a point where i feel comfortable with ordering online and the one thing i can say is by this being the walmart junior line like size 11 to size 13 large i think i can get away with ordering largest on fashion nova um, fashion to figure I know exactly what size I wear because it's number sizes and I wear a 12 so I can order from there and I can also order from pretty little thing because I wear a size 12 and they have number sizes but yeah I just before I went and just did big purchases on there I was like let me just see what it's hidden for here and plus it's already here so I can start wearing this stuff and get myself together because I'm gonna get my hair sewn in I have another nail appointment coming up and your girl just tired of looking bummy like I'm finna bring it so get ready like you know ground crew so it's coming back so i hope y'all ready for it but yeah that's everything i picked up from walmart it ended up being i did buy some more stuff i bought um some body stuff like i bought nair i bought deodorant i bought body wash stuff like that but with everything end up being a hundred dollars for everything and then i think when i did the math it ended up being like eighty dollars just for that so that's not bad i literally got five shirts three pair of pants a dress and a rumper for eighty dollars and i'm lit too lit for lit or whatever but yeah that's everything that i picked up from walmart big lots and dollar tree and then i'm updated you guys on the weight loss yes i lost another 2.6 pounds and like i said i haven't been working out like i'm supposed to when it comes to cardio and stuff i have been doing my planking i do lunges i do squats and stuff like that but I just haven't did any cardio. So this week I definitely want to start getting my cardio in. So I'm gonna figure out some type of workout routine um, that I can do, you know, going to work, getting off of work, figuring out the time and everything like that. So I'll update you guys more about the workout portion of my journey in the next vlog. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know everything that's going on now. It is 4.12 now. Baby is still asleep because she worked this morning. So she been asleep all day. That's why your girl been out and about. I did go by my mom's house. She got us some hand sanitizer, some N95 mask, and some regular just like throwaway mask so we can just keep in the car just in case we ever need it. Or if we see somebody that doesn't have a mask and need one because I'm that kind of person. Like I feel like everybody needs to wear a mask. Like everybody needs to wear a mask so if i need to give you one i'll give you one especially since we out and about moving around and stuff you know i just want us to be safe all of us want this pandemic pandemic over so we can get back to normal life which we all know that this is the new norm like people don't do right and i can talk about that over and over and over so i'm not gonna bore y'all with that but yeah baby is asleep so she'll be waking up about 5 or 5 30 and then i need to figure out what to eat because the only thing i've had today was dunkin ice coffee 
that's it i have not had any food i did take my energy this morning um so i'm not hungry <laughs> um but i am gonna eat dinner with baby so we're gonna figure out what that is um whenever she gets up but i'm gonna go ahead and close out the vlog i know i've been hitting you guys with hour hour and a half vlogs but that honestly is because i vlog over a certain amount of time so it ends up being that long but since this was kind of just a day vlog that's why it's not as long and i kind of like these too because it just kind of updates you guys on you know what i'm doing right now and not fully just like boom this is my meal prep and stuff like that which i know you guys enjoy those videos and i enjoy doing them for you so i definitely will have some recipes in the next vlog um like i said i want to do this sausage and cheese uh biscuit drops with you or drop biscuits and they call drop biscuits because you don't make them perfect you just literally drop the dough on there and then how it bakes is how it bakes um and i'll just show a picture of that in there because you know that was really like literally those were so good and then i need to make the soup for you guys and then i have a couple of sweet recipes to do so yeah y'all saw that i got my rib which i don't even need to open that yet because i still have nutriburst in the refrigerator i still have nrg and i still have teas that i'm going so i don't even have to open it i just like having it on hand and like i told you i'm with drop ship so i get it monthly no matter what it's like they send me an email and say hey crystal we took this money out your account then they send me an email let me know it's shipped and then i get it at the door so i I love it it is working wonders for me for those who have purchased from me thank you so much remember i said keep me updated you guys can hit me up on instagram let me know how it's going if you have any questions or concerns you can dm me on there if you don't want to talk in the comments here um but i appreciate all of you i appreciate the support and it's just like i always say you have to get your mind right when it comes to your journey and at the end of the day all of us are different and all of us will lose weight different and all of us take different things to lose weight but when you find what works for you you do that until it don't work anymore you know what i'm saying and the reason i say it don't work anymore because you know our body will get to a point where it will plateau out and stuff like that so that's kind of how i feel and the reason i even wanted to start with that one i wanted to try it because like i told you guys i love detoxing i have detoxed my whole weight loss journey i know some some people say oh well i don't do detoxes i don't need to do detoxes i lose weight without it well congratulations sis i'm glad you do but i have always been a detox person one i'm a camel and i hold water so i need to detox and, and for two it just works for me it's what i've done my whole journey like these whole two and a half years that i've been on my journey since 2018 i have always did a detox tea always so this is not nothing new for me you know what i'm saying but i'm enjoying the product i use it until i feel like it doesn't work for me you get what i'm saying but as of right now i'm loving the results because like i told you guys i have not been able to do any cardio workout and your girl still lost 2.6 pounds this week so it works you know what i'm saying but i'm gonna go ahead and end it out for today if you're not this is your time to go ahead and subscribe and turn your notification bell on to be notified when i post the next vlog and i'll see you guys really soon